deep in the shadowy lands of a place called Hormikosa, a young Meronoplus bicolor walker is foraging in search of food. However, even after foraging through a large area, the Meronoplus walker has found no food. So it has decided to move forward towards more promising lands. However, here it must be careful for this is the land of the Fedols and it has heard from the elders that some of the Fedole ants known as the Dark Fedols have killed several of their kind in the past. However, though there is a great risk, the Melanoplus walker cannot return back to the nest empty-handed. So putting down all of his fears, it moves forward carefully. And as soon as it enters the green mossy land, it comes across a fatally wounded ant queen. The Melanoplus walker immediately walks to the wounded queen and hurriedly starts to make efforts to pull the motionless queen towards his nest. But just then, a young Lopomirmix walker appears and it looks like the Lopomirmix walker is also keen to claim this nutritious food for itself. But the Meronoplus walker strikes fast and drives away the novice Lopomirmix walker using its venom. However, though it has successfully defended its hard found food, the body of the queen is heavy and the Meronoplus walker is not being able to pull it towards its nest. But the Meronoplus walker is not the one to give up easily and so after much effort the Meronoplus walker is finally able to move the motionless body of the queen and it begins to slowly move the queen towards its nest. But the way back to its nest is not easy and just as the Meronoplus walker is trying to pull up the queen's body through the hood, a Lopomirmix warrior appears and aggressively attacks the Meronoplus walker decapitating the wings of the poor queen in the process. The young Meronoplus ant is greatly frightened and runs quickly towards its nest, forgetting everything. On the other hand, the Lopomirmix walker begins to examine the body of the queen, biting it repeatedly as if trying to walk out a way to carry it towards its nest. Finally, as if having chalked out a plan, the Lopomirmix walker begins to carry the almost dead queen towards its nest. But the queen is heavy and as the tired Lopomirmix walker is taking rest on the way, a Fedole walker appears and begins to examine the body of the dead queen. Strangely, instead of attacking the Fedole walker, the Lopomirmix walker leaves the place when it becomes aware of the presence of the Fedole walker. But the Fedele worker also appears young and inexperienced. It just looks confused and it appears that it does not know what to do. The smell of the dead queen has already begun to attract other opportunistic ants. When it is just looking like the Fedele worker will lose its food when a big-headed Fedele soldier appears. And the Fedele soldier immediately begins to carry away the dead queen towards its nest with the Fedele worker following him behind happily. But suddenly, the Lopomimix ants are seen marching towards the Fedole ants. The Lopomimix walker had left earlier to get help. And so, the big-headed Fedole soldier is attacked by the Lopomimix ants. But the big-headed Fedole soldier is strong and fight back aggressively. Seeing its aggression, most of the Lopomimix ants refrain from attacking the Fedole major. And so the Fedole Major easily overpowers and kills the lone Lopomimix ant that had attacked it. Leaving its attacker dead on the ground, the Fedole Major walks around to see if there are any more challengers. And when none appears, it picks up the dead queen and hurriedly carries it towards its nest. <laughs> 